This week's Patreon shout out goes to Safi. Safi, fuck. Um, uh-huh. uh-huh. Safi Musgrove. Um, thank you for being on our Patreon and being as rotted and gutted as George is. Thank you for this. Thanks, Safi. What? what? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I'm, and cut. But no, thank you. I don't, know, thank you. I don't, oh. I don't know what <laughs> We all go a little mad. Oh, you know. oh, oh, you know. oh, 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 Hello and welcome to the Horror Hour, the show where we discuss, debate, and disagree on all things horror. Um, I'm one of your hosts, Liam. Hello. Um, today I am joined by Miss uh, Utica. Colorado. How's it going? Um, just Ms. a PSA Co- for uh, Miss Flo- George. Miss Florida. Oh, yeah, dear. I know that is so oh. rude. Mm. Mm-hmm. I mean, but adequate. <laughs> Probably is going to be said a lot. Um, so speaking of messes, George, hi. Hi, I've got my new look today. We're, we're giving, um, it's spooky season now, so I'm wearing flannel. I sh- um, had a haircut and I just want to give like, you know, he could turn nasty on the M4 sort of vibes. So that's a motorway for the, all the Americans. Sorry. Flannels. Freeway. Or autumn. Groundbreaking. Groundbreaking. <laughs> <laughs> I, think we, I think we need a jacket here. <laughs> Cerulean. But. <laughs> she wears her flannel for dogging. Oh. Um, and last but not least, the rotted, gutted, and messy bitch, David. Hi. Hello. Ha- Wait, what the fuck? Am I getting a text? I want to breed your hole, you dirty slut. Oh, Why is my sorry, cousin that texting me? came through a while ago. <laughs> I'm so- I'm- anyway, sorry, guys. How are y'all doing today? <laughs> and to-, to my apparent boyfriend, how are you, George? How- yeah, can how- we just, like, what was that? I went I, up to like, you know, <laughs> I choose to be vulnerable on the socials of media and people automatically think that I'm crushing on George, oh. Utica and Nick. Mm-mm, I, would, I, no, I think I got that, brought in you, that last that no, nasty one. That disgusting, <laughs> vulgar. I couldn't sleep last night. All I saw was something about. What was it? Uh, fucking! I don't know. What, I don't know what kind of nasty. And they include and they included poor Chew on it too. <laughs> I gotta keep my emotions to myself next time. But that's just right? a nice person. <laughs> but then Liam had to put himself in because he was sad. And no, I will not tell anybody who it is. But <laughs> <gasps> oh, the drama, oh. guys! Let us know in the comments below who is it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I think we should start a poll. <clears throat> oh my god! <laughs> Follow Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> the Patreon exclusive. <laughs> oh dear. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, um, so today's episode, we are going to be discussing the most annoying characters uh, in horror. Mm-hmm. Not on the podcast in <laughs> horror movies. Yeah. yeah, but obviously it's in celebration of George. Yes. Um. <laughs> It's true. Listen, hey, people wanted uh, most of the comments that had this oh. said they wanted to hear me. So I blame y'all. Whoever's what I blame y'all for making this happen. Honey. Y'all it, let him onto this. A I blame y'all. Yeah, you tell them, Shangela. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, so <laughs> let's keep this going as long as possible without George having to speak, and let's go to Utaka first. Oh. oh. I wasn't prepared. No, I didn't. Um, so I, 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 right. So I don't have a character per se because I, I picked like a character trait or like a trope that we sometimes see, and uh, because there are so many of these character types, but it's those like overly butch mask men who also <laughs> not like porn, but um, <laughs> but that are really just like they won't listen to anybody. They're gonna do what they want. They're either one going to end up getting people killed. Or hopefully they get themselves killed. Um, but typically, sometimes they have like the worst dialogue, or they're just portrayed really just not even a fun way. Just you're like, oh my! I know God, exactly who you're talking about. Oh, and Trent, you? Do you remember Trent? Yes, from, from Fight, Fight of the Thirteenth. 
premium. <laughs> yes. yes. You have perfect nipple placement. I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> and then he's like, stupendous. And I'm yeah. like, what? who? Huh? Yes. Oh, God. He's one yeah. of them. It, like, ugh. Yes. That's a perfect example. He, he thought he ate that shit up. I was like, girl. I mean, she was gorgeous. I mean, she yes. was not, yeah, she was feeling her fantasy. She was like, oh, yeah. I was like, okay. I'm sure it's not that good, but sure. You know, because, you, you know, when you're getting filmed, you have to, you know, perform a little more. So, you know, I understand that. Yeah. Well, Didn't he have nice. like a camcorder too? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. Wasn't she was getting this recorded. Like the, this was still like... 2009. Yeah. This well, was... we still had good camera phones. So like, I'm still well... trying to... Oh, okay. That's true. No, we Actually, didn't. That was it a you're woman? right. <laughs> that could have been great if you had like a flip phone and oh, was dear. recording on a phone. Like on exhibit A? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> she's either getting giving head or she lost her glasses What's, i can't see the pixels are too, i don't yeah <laughs> but yeah that would be mine yeah good Ooh. times uh so david what is your first one well listen i don't want to be redundant so i'm gonna i'm gonna give the bitch from the babadook a break for today but we all know oh, no that. but that's what we want that- <laughs> But I mean, I've given y'all so many rants about this poor young boy. I'm going to let him rest for today. <laughs> Next week, I'll bring him up again. But for me, the one that came to mind, oh my God, I love, y'all know, I, I I like this movie a little bit, but is Kinsa from Jason X? Oh. Um. <laughs> you yeah. pissed me off so much because when she wouldn't open that fucking door, she was like, <laughs> Kinsa, open the fucking door. And I was like, girl, she because she first of all she got laid so i don't know why she was crying and i was like she so pretty and then she wouldn't open the fucking door and she ruined half of the fucking shit the fucking spaceship was going into black she put my janessa in danger i mean oh, in danger <laughs> oh lord she didn't mer- she didn't make it back <laughs> well that's you right you're right but yeah she was just so annoying because she was like she was like that character that's just like is almost like a barbara we're like mm. what's going on like oh, i'm just here to look yep. pretty i'm like but Wake the fuck up, bitches! Are co- like, I I hate those characters. Where it's just like, oh my god, what's going on? I'm like, I, it just makes me want to smack the shit out of. I, I don't like that. But yeah, she she was very pretty, a beautiful body. Because yeah, when gals. she was getting beautiful licked gals. up, I was like, oh yeah, she was hot. But oh my god, she was so annoying. I was like, thank god she died because I couldn't bear her anymore. I was like, blow up, honey. Yeah, <laughs> honestly, <laughs> I could have done with really a Jason feel- kill, honestly, but, that's, <laughs> but I guess leave that for the imagination. But yeah, no, she got on my nerves because I was like, yeah, but that's just me. That's fair. Yeah, again, Kendall. gorgeous body. I mean, she was so hot. Yeah, it's the stomach for me. There's something about a belly button that I really like. No, I'm okay. Never mm-hmm. mind. Yeah, Moving on. <laughs> you know, when you come on the stomach and the nut is just like, in the, and, okay, anyways, <laughs> <laughs> just like a little pool, <laughs> yeah, and then you like suck it, anyways. Okay, yeah. next, <laughs> this is in the after hours. <laughs> Y'all gotta rain me back a little bit, <laughs> Woo! Damn. anyways. Moving uh, on, <laughs> so, so next will be May. Um. Oh dear. Hi, George. Um, I'm going for my first annoying person. I'm going for Miss Julie James. Oh, I, oh bitch, yeah. go fix your hair, fix your mug. Like, ugh. I mean, particularly oh, in part one. Yes. So she got more, be- you um, know. Yeah. Like, she washed her hair in this end one. It was fine. Yeah. She had um, a bit of more color. Was, yeah. She, she was, was still annoying. Fucking. But at least she died. was washed. Yeah. That, I loved her in part two more. Yeah. She, yeah part one, she. Like a morphine at a time. Yeah. Hey, oh, just such a wet blanket. Hey, slap the fuck out of it. Um, I like George's rag. Oh, that's as stiff as a board. You could crack that over a knee. Hey. That could be used as a weapon in a horror movie. <laughs> it could. Trauma. <laughs> Severe head trauma. <laughs> <laughs> This mm. wound is salty. Um. Anyway. Um, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh Jesus. No. Especially no. when you see Helen, and then she walks up, and you're like, "Damn, could you take some notes?" Because Helen was living her best. She was like, uh, <laughs> "Head, head, full, 
mini skirt. I was like, you better work, bitch. Best chase scene. Like, yeah, exactly. Like, how can how can that be the antagonist? And also, what's his name? Like, when he was sorry. like, y'all both look like shit. I was like, you must have cataracts in one eye. Because you got me <laughs> fucked up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yes, I know. <laughs> I was like, yeah, Julie, sure. But no, 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 honey. You need to get your eyes checked, bitch. <laughs> uh, there's another one of my, um, not Ray, but what's the Ryan Felipe's character's name? Yeah, so I'm, I forgot his name. That, that he would yeah. be another one who's like. Oh, God. Yeah. Saying. I liked Ryan Felipe in that. Well, at least we saw the list. Yeah. Either way, I had a good time with him. Um, (laughs) Yeah. um, Yeah. So that would that would be mine. Um, So yeah, I think that's a yeah. Uh, So you tagger. What's your second one? Uh, Oh. (laughs) (laughs) (sighs) George, (sighs) are we getting the rant? I just there's no point in ranting because I've done it so many times and I'm just gonna keep this one short and sweet. She's versatile, darling. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah. She's versatile. Look unlike... at this. This is growth. Yeah. yeah. Something we didn't see in Laurie Strode's character because she was just abysmal throughout the whole series. Um, I just don't like her. We've said it before. I don't really actually need to I'm not gonna rant because I know that you're talking about <laughs> <laughs> No, David, you're going to mess up my screen when I have to edit now. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Oops. Um, yeah, I, I didn't particularly, in, I thought, I didn't particularly enjoy her in the first film. I just thought she was very bland and boring and just quite whiny. Um, and then, I mean, the second one, she was fine. I didn't, then she disappeared. Then she came back and... Like, I didn't watch H2O until, like, last year because I was like... Okay, How well. dare you on that one? That is um, a great fucking film. Yeah. Um, it also it also doesn't make sense because it also says that she died in the car crash. Obviously, she survived that. So does that mean that she just abandoned Jamie somewhere? Because that still happened, that car crash. So she left a daughter. Great. Good for her. Um, And then in this new one... I would have, too. Where... But, uh, mm? Don't speak ill of Danielle Harris like that. Um, well, Amy made stupid choices, oh, and then what, she's like trauma and became mute. Oh, and honey, like, ah. you want to talk? Oh. You want to talk about making stupid choices? This woman spent forty years of her life trying to make Fort Knox for a man who didn't even care about it. He shot. She shot him. He he couldn't walk away fast enough, and then she continued. Do you know what? I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind in the your in dates that, say the same thing. I don't be having any dates, darling. But what I will say is that I wouldn't Truth. mind Truth. if at the end of yeah. this Halloween 2018, she was like, do you know what? That's fine. He doesn't care about me. But then she like continues to go on about him in Halloween Kills. Like he's like, this has got to die. Like, honey, he's just trying to go home. We've all been there we, on a night out when we just want to go home. And then you've got some annoying person going, hang on a minute. I want to go to the chippy. No, Jamie, no one wants to the chip shop. It's like a takeaway. Um, no, dragging you back, oh, and that's what sorry. he keep, that's what he keeps doing. So anyway, yeah, my number one. I'm not. I didn't need to say anymore. I'm wrapping it up because um, the, I've got the director in my ear, the producer saying I have to hurry up. Um, so yeah, it's she's just not my cup of tea. But I won't disparage anybody who likes her because I'm not a complete dick. So if you like On her, camera, yeah, good for you. <laughs> I hope you're happy and healthy. Thank you. Mm, good you test. Well you. done. Wow. That was Ain't that shit. was real fun. I was really proud of you. The growth. Yeah. Was, was um, um there's something the wrong with your you statement. Have. Yeah. But yeah. That's my opinion. I know. And opinions are like assholes. Well, what you said was some always bullshit. messy and always <laughs> willing to be eaten. <laughs> Thank you for I, that. I, I, yeah, I, yeah. I, 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 you t- you take us away with something <laughs> interesting. Uh, okay. Please so bring this podcast annoying... back. <laughs> yes. All right. So another annoying character. All right. Um, oh, okay. Dear. So no, no. I had to say... his indecisions. That's my next one. I, I know. I'm sorry. I didn't. I wasn't prepared because I couldn't. I love horror. So in because terms like old. there's. I know. Um, okay. I love the film. But we can all agree her screaming kind of got a bit on our nerves. And I don't like to speak ill of Miss Flo or Florence Pugh. But we got to admit 
her character in Midsummer got a bit much. Her scream? Now, or, like, well, I mean, her, her crying. Mm. That's true. Everybody was. I still love the film, but that I think... terrible. Uh, yeah. What? That three-hour director cut girl, I... Okay. Anyways. I, I wanted to gouge my eyes out of boredom. I mean, I know she just lost her family film. and she, but that, that crying, that wailing and, uh, but then also I'm going to go back to her, you know, my first thing that, that, um, you know, trope. And we look at her boyfriend who was good looking, but very stupid. And, you know, Paid the pretty price. much it's because of all the men that, you know, that whole thing happened. Well, and the cult, but you know, I'm sure some <laughs> and the cult. probably, you know, well, she made was kind of slow because she didn't get the hint. Like, mama, they don't want to be around you. Like, yeah. <laughs> I would. Oh, no, 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 honey. But I understand that her family died and all that stuff. But, you know, it happens. Life moves on. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I don't know. I. I, I... You know, I just like, would have started fucking somebody else, honestly, because it was like when she's when she looked on the people and he was fucking another another bitch. Everybody was harmonizing like Destiny's Child. Everybody was like, I'm, I just don't understand. This on whole key, though. That, well, they didn't fall. <laughs> they didn't... <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that whole that whole movie was I mean, I. I, lo- I mean, I do love a good scream. I love a good like when they're crying like Tony Collette. You that's know. different that was a good str- I, I, you know that was a good one Oof. like when she's on the floor and she's like Ugh. yeah yeah <laughs> I like that <laughs> I like that but uh, yeah she was a little I mean I didn't like anybody in that movie but I just like what mm-hmm. was going on yes okay that would be fair yes because the characters were really pissing me off but yeah. I do love that film I also just love the the whole color palette and just everything that they built, you know. But anyways, yeah. My, I, I'll oh my God, say... when his lungs are still breathing and he's open. Oh, yeah. That, that is was so good. <laughs> and he just, he just walks up like, oh, my God, is this on display? Like, what <laughs> is I'm this? Like, yeah. Is it the Guggenheim Museum? You dumb? <laughs> like, oh, my God, girl. I don't understand. He's dumb. He had it coming, honestly. Well, that's just my... Because <laughs> I remember I, the comments were like, how could you? He got raped. I was like, well, he was annoying before he got raped. So what am I supposed to do? <laughs> like what? Anyway, oh, we, the, I bring it up every it's episode. Gotta get it in at least <laughs> that, once or twice. A, a bingo. <laughs> like, it's gonna be like a Law and Order SVU every episode for you. <laughs> <laughs> um, don't bring my sex life into this. Um, but anyways, <laughs> let's move on. <laughs> I agree. Danny was a bit of an annoying character. Oh my god. Well everybody, done. Everybody was mm-hmm. the. The one that wanted the book, the one that was like that got pubes in his hair and his food. Well, uh, which I mean, you know, when you're giving a guy head and you get some pubes in your teeth and all that stuff, but that's different. You know it's coming. You don't go to the pancake house and expect to get pubes in your pan. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Um, yeah, if you go to the pancake house, you probably are. You probably expected worse. Oh, you remember that video of the guy of the people that were fucking in Popeyes? <laughs> <laughs> and that was on Pornhub. <laughs> That biscuit wasn't dry that day, honey. I'm well, telling you that. <laughs> yeah. And she was just like taking it up. I was like, you better work. Well, speaking mm. of you working, uh, David, what's your second annoying okay. person? I forget her name, but Marsha Gay Harding mm. in The Mist, she uh, worked on my yeah. last nerve. Because listen, yeah. I love me some Jesus, but I don't know what Kanye West church she was praying at, honey, because she... <laughs> was on another le- I was like the you, it's the cult mentality that really creeps me out when somebody somebody just like has the ability to just like click with everybody and just be like yeah let's fucking let's fuck these bitches up that creeps me out because I'm like if I would have been they would have killed me honey because I what am I gonna do well I mm-hmm. probably would have faked it a little bit I would like but yeah 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 but yeah no you know but she had a, when that when they killed her when that milk she, went I, that felt so good oh my god it felt so good you know, it was kind of what I wanted to see from the, the Babadook. But, you know, but that didn't happen. But the point is, it's just it's just the annoying, like the constantly getting louder and louder and louder. Oh, but she's so good in that role. Just the 
Because again, it's the, it's the religious culty mentality that creeps me out. Because I'm mm-hmm. like, oh, you know, the gays would have been dead in that supermarket hunt. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know because we they worship Marsha Gay Harden. I'm just saying. She's yeah, and she, isn't her daughter gay? Her son, her son, his son, her son, her son. Her son. Oh. That son. <laughs> but I know she's a huge fan of the drag scene too. Yeah, yeah. So I, I freaking love. It's kind of like, um, have y'all seen that? Um, the circle, the, the yes. one that they're on. That remember when they got to the lesbian and she was like, oh. maybe these lesbians, maybe these aliens don't like lesbians. I'm like. <laughs> Got me fucked all the way up. <laughs> so, do you have a husband? Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> that shit fucked me up. I love that. You like stuff like that when, when there's like somebody that's just like, mm, no, I don't like you, honey. We gotta go. Mm, I like that. I so good. Definitely agree with you on that one. <laughs> oh, yeah. That. Played yeah, well, though, because we love Master Gay Heart. Oh, she Gay played Hart, the shit out of that so. role. Yeah, yeah, she yeah. Did. She did. Yeah. yeah. It, but annoying. Mm-hmm. Um, <clears throat> so for my next one, I'm cheating a little bit. Um, I couldn't decide on one of them. So I've picked the whole family from oh. 28 weeks later. Yeah. Like the kids. Because the kids... <laughs> it's all their fucking fault. It's always their fault. It's always their fault. It's always... The kids. I want a picture of my mum. Fucking want a picture of your mum for. She's dead. It's like the guy from your next. I have to see her. I'm like, bitch, she has an axe through her face. What do you want to see, bitch? I'm like, dear God. (laughs) Have mercy. Uh, (laughs) Yeah. So obviously they were Bellens. Did what they did. But then to make matters 10,000 times worse, you have dumb fuck Robert Carlyle over there mm. being like, oh, my wife, I want to kiss her, even though she's a fucking zombie. Yeah. Ooh. Hey, what? What are you doing? And I wouldn't, even, I wouldn't even mind if he didn't know that she was infected, but they were literally like the bloods in us. I mean, what, what, was he there for that? Anyway, regardless, she was in quarantine. Like, she was fucking tied up. She obviously, there's something wrong with her. Poor Rose Burns out there trying to tell everyone. Idris Elba's just trying to get through the day. And... Mm. Suddenly, I'm a fan so of that, that film. Don't you say that, man? I was going to throw something at you through the screen. I said film. Yeah, I know. I thought you were going to say Idris. I thought you were going to say about Idris Elba, and then I was. Oh, gonna I go. would hop on that real quick. I will throw him something, but and I always forget that friggin' whole <laughs> Je- Jeremy Ren is in that film, isn't he? Oh, and there's that other guy that's really annoying in that film, the Scouse one, who's like, "Take me with you." When he gets on the and he starts hanging off the helicopter. And then the what guy driving the helicopter, he's just one of the people who's with them that comes with them. He's got a terrible Scouse accent and he, he gets... Oh, I can't remember. Anyway, sorry, is he a I... popular actor? No, no, he's like a he's like a lanky, tall, druggy looking one. Not even my types. So he's a day player. <laughs> yeah. We'll yeah. Go with that. Liam. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, what part of it's a lanky, drug looking thing did... <laughs> Oh, you a day player. I can not say what, it. A red, what, they, what are they called? Those rooster ones, the red ones that we get in the UK. What are they called? Cock. Oh, yeah. Albert Bartlett. Oh, that's the one. <laughs> oh, I love an Albert Bartlett. Oh, you, oh, oh my God, get, it was like that. You I get them know. potatoes at Christmas because mm. they're the fancy potatoes. Yeah. Like purple potatoes? Yeah, yeah, they're like a like a, a rouge. Oh. Mm. Anyway, so but I do agree those kids were really annoying. Yeah. That guy's like, oh, I've got a, I've got a funny colored eye. Right. It's kind of like remember from is it Dawn of the Dead with the pregnant bitch? Yeah. He was, like, oh. he, he was keeping her in the room, and she was like, "What was that?" He was so like, "Yeah, honey, I would have gotten that wire hanger, and I would have fucked both of them up on it." <laughs> like I was like, "What are you doing?" Like I. I don't and understand, that poor honestly. old Ooh. that old woman died. She was just she had a cigarette oh, and that. No. Yeah, that ain't oh. yelling shit. She you know what? didn't deserve that. She was just having a nice time with a cigarette, making sure everyone was fine. Back when Roe v. I... Wade was still available, you know, it's like <laughs> I don't understand honestly. Like that was just a tragedy to me. When she got cut in that shit, I was like, oh shit. Oh yeah, yeah, no, not a vibe. But yeah, those that kids was... are really annoying. So I agree with you. <sighs> Yes, so the kids and the dad because yeah. we're all fucking stupid and they all should have just died. Good yeah. times. 
Well done, me. Mm-hmm. Um, so, George, um, a number two. Do you have one? Oh, a number two. Um, I do have a number two. This woman, we've talked about trauma a lot. Do we need here. to take a break? No, no. Tra- trauma. We've talked about trauma a lot. And this woman... Um, Generational? ...will blame her the way that she acts on trauma. Sarah from The Descent. Because oh, that okay. woman, like... What? I was like, I was waiting for her to be killed every second. Like she was so miserable. Like, so yeah, like no wonder your husband cheated on you. Like, she's well better looking than you. Um, uh-huh. and then like, yeah, your daughter died. Great. But like now you like car- like she's she carried a grudge more than fucking grudge and the grudge carried a grudge. Like, I can't Ooh. believe like she was just so insufferable. And I think the Scottish accent didn't help. She's like the grudge. She's like, I can't, I can't get through. I'm stuck. I can't do it. I can't do it. Um, what are you putting your things up at me? For? A Utica, a uh, grudge, Utica. anyway. <laughs> um, yeah. So I kind of wish that she had got um crushed by those rocks, but she didn't. And then to top it all off, she fucking whacks Juno in the leg. And I was like, you take that, okay, hold up. But that was smart. Because it, if if that's you in the situation, it's me or you. I'm gonna whack you in the leg. So because I'm fat, it's gonna take me a little bit longer to run. So I need you to be slow so they get you first. So I, I kind of had to. I was like, okay. Work. She she like snapped from like being this like oh, to like fucking the Terminator in like two well, seconds I'm... where she was like and like just not speaking. And I was like, you know, you probably would enjoy that though because it was a whole bunch of Davids in that cave just waiting for you. Oh my god! I Just bald, skinny, and wet. <laughs> yeah, snatched. <laughs> and honey, they were those ears, bitch. When they were on all like on hunched over, I was like, you "Better work, bitch." <laughs> my ancestors, honey, they were getting paid, honey. I love that. <laughs> I, I loved love it when he movie. had a, when he had the like the hand when she was like lying down on the rock and like the hand was on her face. Have you seen that behind the scenes of them just like just like chilling? Yeah, and, yeah. <laughs> and like dance. It's like if you do them like dance. It's Very amazing. Camp, but... I love that. <laughs> oh, I love that. Oh, I'm gonna um, have to search that out. I haven't seen that. That'll be a, it's... such a fucking amazing costume. Oh my god, I would that would be it so up. good for like a scary movie six, like The Descent. Like, could you oh. imagine Brenda and um Cindy? <laughs> and, like, <laughs> they just they just walk into a cave and it's just all them fucking. Yeah. Like it's just like, <laughs> like have y'all seen Haunted Haunted House with the Wayne Brothers? Yeah, <laughs> when it's the Mendingo party. <laughs> <laughs> that film is crazy. I haven't seen that. I thought it was supposed to be shit. Oh no, 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 no! That it movie is actually is... really funny. It's funny, oh, right? Actually, it's better than Scary Movie Five. Oh, yeah. oh yeah, way well, better. Yeah, that one. yeah. There we go, then. honestly, it's like on the level of like maybe like a like the first three scary movies for me. Like I'm mm-hmm. watching, I just crack the fuck up. It's like, really good. Oh, okay. Side. Yeah, I'd recommend it. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to say Sarah from the Descent. I'm glad she died in the second. Sarah. One. Okay, sorry. Oh, <laughs> book. Come on, vibrato. Uh, so Miss uh, Utica, mm-hmm. can you reach into that very, very old brain of yours and pick something else out to discuss? Yeah, I know it's gonna. It's going to get me some hate and, uh, oh, you know, it's going to really, it's going to hit George where it hurts. Uh, you know, I just couldn't stand Is Zachary Paul? Binks. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, oh. Back of day. <laughs> what? Excuse me. Right. Sorry. <laughs> You're telling me. No, I'm. <laughs> oh, I was like. George didn't take gonna, the bait. Liam fair, took the bait because he was, I was busy just putting on his lip. I was, I was going to be like, Max Dennison is sitting right there, and you choose Thackeray fucking Binks. Or fucking Ice. I would. And the one. I don't remember. Ah, ah, I don't remember you mean, Hocus Pocus that much. What? You sound like Sarah Michelle. Sarah, Sarah Michelle Gellar. I just Sarah did Sarah watch this. Hey, <laughs> Sarah Jessica I did Fox. watch the second one. It wasn't bad, but I, I don't watch Hocus Pocus on a yearly basis like you do, George. Um, crying face meme. Uh, you know, I, I don't. So, uh, but no. If if I could think of an annoying character, I will go with a movie that I know George hates. I believe oh. so. He'll love this. Um, and it is 
it, don't give him more fuel. And the, I, but <laughs> I kind of have to on this one because I think we all kind of hated this character because there was no point and they built her up only to for her to come out for two seconds and then just get fucked by a chainsaw. <laughs> Come on, uh, that that character was so annoying, Sally Harkins. It, it it was just especially because I love the original, even though her Elsie Elsie yeah. Fisher's right that again <laughs> going <laughs> yes. for the wrong people here, sir. Wait, Elsie Fisher in that like her... wig is right there. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. That, that is fair. <laughs> but we, I, I remember all of us were like, "What was even the purpose?" Like, well. It was Martin. I didn't mind that they killed her. <laughs> I, didn't I just mind don't like her, her character. What she okay. had become. Because yes. it would have been interesting if she... I wish they would have brought her in in a different way. Where mm-hmm. she was just like trying to like mind her fucking business. And then some... Because I, I love that. I love that death. That she's just like... I, I love <laughs> that. that wasn't her death. <laughs> she got thrown but, in and the and garden. She came up, I'm like, girl. Okay, girl. I don't know what, I don't know what activity you'd be taking, honey. But you can't. <laughs> Can't be coming back that many times. You can't be pulling off that many shots when yeah, you got- honey. <laughs> but I, yeah, that was, she was so when she locked them up. I was like, oh lord. In the car, that, I was like, exactly. I'm like, you're trying to protect them, or I'm like, what the? F-? And then she didn't shoot him when she was right in front of him. I was it's- like, okay. <laughs> now, if she would have walked in, you know, okay, you know, if she would have walked into that room ready to shoot and he would have just thrown that fucking chainsaw at her and killed her then, maybe that would have been more satisfying to me. But it was just the whole trying to like, oh, no, I will. I will. But no, I won't. I will. But no, I, I'm like, girl, just fucking kill him. Like you try at least. You actually. Oh, that that would have been a good scene. Instead of swapping out the girl with the luscious locks. I loved her curly hair. Um, Sarah She's Arkin's gorgeous. Hair. I mean, she is yeah. stunning. Yeah, um, yeah swap out that scene and have like him throw the hammer at Sally. Oh. See, like that would like you kind of just gave me that idea. And I'm like, oh, that would have been Yeah, because that makes sense. Cause it was like yes. she's trying, she wants to kill him, but he just two steps ahead and he's just like, yeah, that would have been fun. That would have been ooh. Yeah. Cause I that like scene, that. that scene was good. I, I was like, it. shit, yeah. they can't even do that in the last Thor. But you know, I digress. You lost me. Yeah, I know. Okay. Yeah. That lost a lot of people. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, so it, it was just a shame. They could have done a lot with the character, but they just, the character choices they gave her. Maybe she'll come back for the next one. Maybe she's still alive. <laughs> yeah, you know. She's just sitting in that garbage waiting for them to pick it up. <laughs> yes. I've waited a year. For the... <laughs> yeah. I can see Evil that. Evil dies tonight. <laughs> oh, y'all are horrible. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so, Master David, oh, master. you have another. Well, yeah. My name is Dita, and I'll be your <laughs> um, <laughs> For me, the one, the only one that comes to mind is Scrappy Doo. Ah! <laughs> yes! It's always the small ones, isn't it? The thing that is so big, and I'm like, girl, you would have thought. We was like, it, watching that movie, I was like, oh, just, ugh, like, then he pissed on Daphne. No, you don't piss on Daphne. Like you don't. You <laughs> okay, don't do but that. that that made me laugh though. I'm yeah, not, he was, yeah, that was kind of funny. But <laughs> it was, it was just, It's always the just the little annoying little shit that you just want to like. He was so. But I mean, he did. He met. I mean, that plan was genius, honestly. But you know, <laughs> but I love that last scene when he's just like in the little bit like. Eh, I love that. But it, just the entirety of listening to him talk, it was just like trying to be listen. I'm like. Girl, you ain't bringing nothing to the table. Look at look at all this buffet, you, honey. Look at every, look what they're serving, and then you over here like, no, I'm sorry, you gotta go. Yeah. But he, I mean, he was masterful, but he was annoying. Oh my god! But that, but that was that was funny when he was chasing Scooby and the big when he turned big and he was veiny and all that stuff. Reminds me of like um, Folsom. what's the name like Austin? Wo- huh? <laughs> <laughs> When he was choking him, at, yeah, and he was almost out passed out. Yeah, yeah, it was very Austin. Yeah, yeah. Rock, rock sacra? What? Oh, oh, Ooh. what do, what don't I know? Ooh. He's into choking. We'll discuss it in the after show. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> uh, speaking of the app, speaking of after show, if you would like to join our Patreon so you can watch them after shows, please do. All the links will be provided below. She works on QVC, honey. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> As you can see, video promotion. 
<laughs> a lovely necklace. <laughs> yeah. As sported by George. Uh, it's uh, funny. Funny. Those aren't pearls. It's oh. what's known as cheap shit, chatty. Well, yeah, I mean, I mean, child labor is still available, so you know, we, <laughs> you know, that's how we get it cheap. Um, but yeah, no, he was really annoying, and I, but but he turned the party that ending. But damn it, he had it coming. Oh mm-hmm. yeah, <laughs> it was such a good film. I haven't seen that in okay. Oh, that I watch week. in yearly basis. Yeah. yeah, I haven't watched it this year. That fight but, scene with Daphne. Now who's the damsel in distress? I am. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up. So fucking good. Those boots, bitch. Oh, my God. I can't. Anyways. But yeah, that's I still the- giggle. That's the, um, because I had the, <laughs> I love poop humor, fart humor. Sorry. Oh, my um, God. And so when they're in the, um, <laughs> the suit. Oh, you're the, the reason fart humor keeps on coming back on Drag Race. Uh, but- oh, <sighs> da- do they have I mean, there, there there are a couple people that you know have been on this channel or on this channel that use them in their videos, and I find them very funny. Yeah, George, I have to mention that. Like, I'm sorry, it's getting a little <laughs> bit overplayed in my opinion. <laughs> Man, <laughs> but I love how you, you think all the ever... sound effects. Um, anyways, <laughs> but yeah, uh, no, that yeah, that's. I mean, the whole movie, even part two. I love part two, honestly. <laughs> like, uh, part two oh, is fun. Yeah, but part one. That like, when she goes to see the the guy on the beach, and he's like, and the chicken. He, yeah, and he's like, here's a clue. Purple's a fall color. It's the middle of <laughs> May. And... <laughs> he read the shit out of her. I was like, you better work, bitch. <laughs> It was very um, legally blonde. Remember? Oh, that is okay. I... Yeah, just a little Pretty bit awesome. more butch, but yeah, yeah, it was very that. Yeah, yeah. Just but, oh, oh my god, it was so good. I love that. Just when I mean, everything about that movie was so much fun. When they're getting possessed and and Velma goes just like like that. I love that vibrate vibration that was going on, and she was like having an orgasm. I was, I was like, you better work. I love Linda Cardellini, so I've been watching her since um, ER. So I was happy to see her as Velma. She was great. George she ER was, was a ER. show that was back in Utica's days. So I've yeah, vaguely heard of it. I think I yeah. saw a VHS tape once. Like, yeah, correct. I mean, exactly. one of your queens was in it, so I think you'd know of it. It's 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 that old. It wasn't even on VHS. It was on Betamax. One of my queens was in it. She was on Doctor Who. Ooh. Alex Kingston. Oh, was she in uh, ER? She was on ER for like five, seven years. Damn. Yeah. Actually, I vaguely remember her being on an American show, but yeah. <laughs> that would it. be the American show. <laughs> Spoilers. Yeah, she was a I very popular song. character. People mm-hmm. loved her. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Have you ever been to Krispy Kreme? Mm-hmm. Have you been to Krispy Kreme? Was it crispy? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, nobody's seen that meme. Fine. No. Some of you aren't TikTokers. No. Sure, you lost me on that one. The people on Apparently, I'm on TikTok, but I don't even know. (laughs) Oh. Don't want to know what video that is. I don't want to know either. I I keep getting DMs of people. But so is George trying to dance in a onesie. You brought it up. George, what are you doing on TikTok? Have mercy. Where am well, I dancing a onesie? Are you being are you being facetious? Is it someone else that you're saying is me? No, it was you in that gorgeous house, and you were like trying to do the whole spooky theme. I mean, I laughed at you, not with you, but was he naked? I don't think you can do that on TikTok, can you? No. Oh, you mean the silhouette challenge? Yeah, you mean <laughs> the Sydney Honey, Prescott one. Have mercy. You no, know, you had the John Carpenter theme playing. You can't even remember your own TikToks, and I'm pretty sure you had to wear something because it was sponsored. Oh, no, that, was that, a, that was wasn't a onesie. Prescott. That wasn't a onesie. That was an what Oodie. Was it? It was an oh, you're talking about the Oodie, and that wasn't Halloween. That was um the, what's no, the name? No, no, was that, that was one. Reba's song. It was Reba, wasn't it? Yeah. No, you had that one, and then you had one where it was fall, and you were dancing, and I don't know. It was at your parents' house, I think. It was an Oodie. I love that. What is oh, that? Oh, I've got an Oodie. They're huge. I'm sponsored. I can get you a discount. Oh, um, it's so big. It's the huge. Ooh. It's his ass. Don't say that about Liam. He's right there. <laughs> that's an Udi. It's basically it's Udi. a hoodie that's like a big blanket, basically. Oh, that looks <gasps> comfortable. It it's does. really nice. And it's got loads. It's got like Oh my nice... God, is that a... <gasps> they do loads. I'm sure you do. But... Um... <laughs> oh my God, it's friends. 
Yeah, it's all sheep inside. Who are we as friends? Oh, oh. I'd assume four, it's four sheep. Yeah. Um, not real. You're, well, you, you'd probably be Monica. Who? Who? You, David. Ma- me, Monica? Or maybe you'd be Phoebe. I Phoebe. thought it would be Chandler. Oh, you would so uh, sarcastic. He'd be, he'd be, yeah, he'd be Chandler. Yeah, it's quite <laughs> annoying. Yeah, I thought. <laughs> <laughs> and he's so sarcastic. Like he. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I already know who I'd be, and I don't like it. Who would you be? I'd probably Ross. Be Ross. Yeah, I knew it. Because he's on old a and break. yeah. yeah okay. <laughs> Have mercy. Yeah. George if I could Rachel. land me somebody like Jennifer yeah, Aniston, I would I'm be Rachel. Saying. <laughs> Not with those fashions. Oh, 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 oh. Um, she came to um, read tonight. <laughs> I don't know how this one can read, darling. <laughs> on fashion. I I don't pretend to know anything. And neither about do fashion. I. Well, it's true. It took you how long for all of us to tell you to cut your hair and you That's finally not... did. And now look at it. it. Looks great. Come on, everybody. You look really handsome. You actually do. Yes. Okay, can we move on? Because it's embarrassing. <laughs> Liam, well, I gotta prop you, you up one? so I can tear you down later. Um, I have a one last one, and um, mine is uh, Freddie Harris from Halloween Resurrections, aka mm. Buster Y. I thought we were gonna say Tyro. <laughs> oh. Well, yeah, I mean, she's just in real life. <laughs> As you keep I saying, think... she's right there, Liam. Yeah, but like Buster's more annoying. Yeah, like Tyra's so... just bad at acting. Like the character itself isn't annoying. Tyra's just bad at acting. Yeah. Even though, like, she could. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm feeling sick. <laughs> I was acting. <laughs> no, Tyra, you weren't. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, I remember when she so, wore the yeah. fat suit. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How many of you were scared in that moment? I was. Me too. I was really scared. (laughs) Have mercy. Where are the straights? (laughs) (laughs) I can't believe that was on TV. Oh, I can. (laughs) That her show was. Oh my god! Oh, so I I ate it up, and when I was in in school, honey, I would come home and I would have a I would have a DVR. Oh, Jesus. Anyways. But yeah, so I didn't go for Tyra. I was initially going to go for Tyra, but I was like, no. I was like, because Tyra's character isn't annoying. Tyra, Tyra's just bad at acting. Yeah. Where Buster Rhymes is not really any Except better. Except in Life Size. But... She always has my heart in life, life Size. Okay, I'll give you that one. I will yeah. give you that one. Um, Yeah, like Buster Rhymes movie, isn't George. really acting. He's just Buster Rhymes. Um, and like the fact that you like everything that happens in the film, like he's watching it, he doesn't know it's happening. It's like, what are you doing? And he swears he would have, he was gonna eat it up with with Miss Michael. I was like, you better okay. Like <laughs> uh, you sit down, Buster Rhymes, with his sharpie this eyebrows. Is... Exactly. This is not your story. Get out of it. Um. Yeah, it was just really annoying. Um, like I don't really have much to say on him because that film. Well, I mean, shit. everybody um, in that movie was quite annoying, questionable. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, especially that woman at the beginning of the film that came in and tried to. She fell off a building. Oh fuck me! Um, I'm ready to push right. you off a building. <laughs> <laughs> George He's ruined it. I mean, you could just step in a crack and oops, crack in the floor. You're talking about me? Or what are you not talking about me? No, I'm not you. It was a family guy skit. Sorry. <laughs> oh. About Kate Moss. It cracked me up. I, I, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> Have mercy. That was a compliment, so... George. I said you were skinny. <laughs> Thank you. He so is skinny. skinny. Yeah. He's got that nose. Mm-hmm. I feel like Lady, <laughs> La- Lady Gaga in um, A Star is Born. <laughs> I was gonna say Barbara, but sure, for the newer people, for the younger people. <laughs> I was thinking Barbara too, but you yeah. know, we haven't seen a Barbara Streisand film. I saw it in Meet the Fuckers. That now it's that's the yeah, yeah that's no. the film you 
saw Barbara in. I swear. Okay, I gotta give you a list. First of all, you have to watch Hello Dolly. Then you have to watch Funny Girl. Then you have to watch The Mirror Has Two Faces. Then you have to watch Yentl. You have to watch these movies. Papa, can you hear me? The soundtrack. Oh my God. Well, oh my God. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, guys, we need to back this up. Mm. Because then this means we could possibly be hearing George sing these songs. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, we, gotta, we don't want to. We gotta we put don't that in. Watch in them. We don't want to watch in them. I mean, I doubt George, she'll like them. Don't watch but... anything Barbara Streisand. Yeah. I mean, the way he ma- when she sings, the way he makes me feel. I by steps. I, 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 they probably I'm about reference. to use the F word. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna Leo, use the F word. This is. I'm gonna oh. use the word. Yeah, he deserves I'm gonna it. Use, yeah. <laughs> Say the what word. Did, what did Tyra say, say on her show? Get that faggot out of my TV screen. I don't want to see it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, George. Oh, now I've just got steps stuck in my head. The, oh, way damn it, George. the way that you make me feel. Oh, that's such a good Being song. in my world of is, that, is that what the original song is? No, it's a completely different song. Completely different song. Okay. <laughs> she has dressed up as a man. And she's in love with a man right, who Bynes. thinks she's a man. Um, yeah, mm-hmm. because because women can't aren't allowed to be educated in those times, so she makes it her plan to her mission to become educated. But she falls in love with a handsome Jewish uncircum well circumcised man. I can't so, imagine what was it like in those times, Yutaka. You know, <laughs> you know, you could see my biopic Mulan. So uh... <laughs> or incantation. <laughs> I thought he was the little boy from The Grudge. Oh, hey, that would be actually accurate since that's Japanese. Just after some pies. Oh, no, you yeah, would be the accurate. one from a scary movie. Cream pie? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, sorry, we went off on tangent. Now. Sorry, but, yeah, uh, George. <laughs> <Because I'm tangent>. <laughs> <laughs> George, do you want to take us? Just, but, yeah, do you have another one? Yeah, I've got one last one. And then, oh, can I? follow up and then after that can we all go around just i want to see if we can do this each video since people do ask and give a spooky movie recommendation oh, sure. oh that is so fun okay. yeah that's cute so george yeah. go hit me yeah. with your last one um what? i'm Sorry, gonna go... i got you liam <laughs> i got you mm. I'm thank you. Sorry, I was just waiting for <laughs> like people just stop talking. Running down um, memory lane with these two. <laughs> but, um I'm gonna go with the character if people this might be quite niche, but I don't know if it's that niche. Um it's Mika from Paranormal Activity, because that man in that first film is like he, he's so annoying. Like, like I understand Is he such a George? He probably would be something I'd do, to be fair. He's like, we haven't had any action in a while. I thought, was he still talking to the demon? Um, he's like, you're going to come and do something. <laughs> to be fair, though, Katie, I mean, I love Katie, but she's like, she didn't tell him that she had a demon attached to him. So he's kind yeah, of got fucked a, up for that. She he's kind shit. of got a right <laughs> to be a little bit pissy with that. <laughs> yeah. Like Hold when we moved though, in. But he way. also brought in a Ouija board in the house. He a did. Ouija? Like, a Ouija board, sorry. A Ouija <laughs> board in the house. So <laughs> I'm just saying, yeah. Mm-hmm. Anybody who does those, that, you can burn. You can die. All those cameras in, and like he was just, he was begging for it to happen. And then in the end, he got what he wanted because he was thrown at a camera. You know, he put all those cameras in that house, but they couldn't fix up that interior. Mm-mm. This was 2007. Okay, this was this is when interior decor in San Diego was it's minimal and... well Utica was still in the nursing home so he was yeah so yeah. <laughs> oh until shady yeah. pines burned down and then you know oh. got, yeah he was too busy watching murder she wrote there would be nothing <laughs> wrong with that <laughs> my mom watches it every day do you ever see that news thing where the where the young where she was in college or something that she just graduated college and she moved into a an apartment complex and you didn't know that it was a nursing home she moved in and she 
Do you know? She walked in. Just, why are these old people like? Yeah. I, do you know something about that? I was looking a few months ago. I was like, oh, I'd love to live in like the Lake District, which is like a really nice like countryside area here in the UK. Um, mm, lots of lakes, surprisingly. Lake mm. Um, not actually and, a lot of lakes. Well, no, but some cu- couple of there's big lakes. There's only one. Well, Lake Windermere. No, there's only one. There must be another lake. There's Lake Windermere and one lake something else. No. Okay. You guys live anyway. there. I don't know. Um, and I was like, oh, this I is your this... fucking home. Like, I, don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I found this lovely apartment. I was like, this is really cheap rent. I was like, I'm going to have to live here. It was only when I was good and I was showing my mum and she was like, can you go through those pictures again? And it was only when I went through them again, I was like, this is stunning, this place that I started to see like the red cord on in the bathroom. <laughs> Um, and then I saw like the, the I was like I was like to my mum, they've even got like a shared lounge, isn't that fun? My mum was like, George, this is a nurse <laughs> sheltered accommodation. And I was Wait like, a minute, I, but it, would it be wrong to move into those places? Because I, I don't was know like, that you can. Yeah, you, can't you, have age restrictions. Like, yeah, you have to be like over fifty five. I was like, honey, I'm not gonna have anybody around. I'm in bed by nine o'clock. I love Poirot. I love Rosemary and Time. I love Murder She Wrote. Like I will watch. All there of was those a time when I couldn't go to bed without watching Poro. Oh, like because just... it's so That's good. What did, David did, did. Suchet. Yeah, I met him. He... he was at my graduation, and I nearly cried because I was like, I've seen Jogger every single on that Poirot. One. And he had he had the better death on the Nile. I know that you like the original original one. You're with like Betty it. Davis and um and Miss Maggie Profe- Smith. Professor Dame. McGonagall. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Maggie Smith's daughter. That, I mean, that sh- bitch fest. Peter used to know. Absolutely. It's a great fucking film. I mean, to me, the best is, what's his name from Oregon Express? He did a good job. Kenneth Branagh. He was so good. And oh, he was hot, too, with that mustache. The the appropriate mustache. Not this fucking SUV that he has on his fucking the new ones. I'm like, girl, this is a bit much. Like, what? A, what? What is this? I mean, yeah. it was all just taken away by... And enough champagne to fill the Nile, I go. That was the bad movie. That remake was bad. That I was still old. have to see it. I I, um, I literally almost walked out of the murder on the Orient Express because I was so pissed off. I was like, "What is this?" Because you can tell the director because he played he he directed and he played Poro. And mm-hmm. I was like, "Girl, <sighs> this is why you can't be having directors acting at the same time." Because I'm Stay like, it was just the camera. it was him all the time. I was like, "Where's Penelope? Where's uh, what's her name? Uh, oh my Michelle God, Michelle Pfeiffer." Uh, no, no, no. Uh, 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 icon Bond movies. Oh, Judy Dench. Yeah, yes, Judy, Judy Dench. Oh, I forgot. I, yes, I was like, where is she? It was just like five minutes. Like, oh, okay. just him I'm and like, Johnny Depp. <laughs> again, I will say this: Penelope Cruz's character, Ingrid Bergman, she won the Oscar for that role, and she was barely on screen in the new one. I'm like, because we know Penelope is a great actress. She won. She has an yes. Academy Award. But I'm like, girl, show the bitch. I'm, I forgot. Uh, I got so mad. I was like, I was. Mm. Mm-hmm. You're gonna like the death of the Nile. Oh, fuck me. It's Have even mercy. it's so bad. Like, <sighs> and the CGI is just gross. Anyway, sorry, but and anyway, that was another tangent. <laughs> I, Mika from Paranormal Activity. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, cool story. I would agree. I would agree. So, as a new little added bonus, shall we say, uh, we're all gonna go around. Shout out a uh, spooky, spooky pick, spooky pick, spooky pick uh, as a recommendation. Mm-hmm. So, you tacker, since you brought it up again, you can go fucking first. Oh my lord. So, <laughs> yeah. so touchy. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, I've only mentioned this movie, uh, I think, once on this channel, um, but it is one of my favorites from the 80s. Uh, it's technically back then, I think it was PG, but if you watched it now, it'd be flirting with like a 13 to an R with some of the gore, but mm. it was still a good film and it's um, Monster Squad. Oh, you love this movie. I do. Yeah. I This was a movie, I, I remember I had the VHS, you all. It's probably dust now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, um, like other things. Yeah, uh-huh. I know. <laughs> but um, yeah, it was just, it, it had like classic monsters. You had um, the Swamp Mon- or um, Creature from the Black Lagoon or Swamp Monster. You also had Wolfman, Frankenstein, Dracula, the Mummy. And it was just really fun. And there was even some like silly sex jokes, you know, like, oh, kind of like in Hocus Pocus. We need to have a virgin to light the candle crap. But it was pretty funny and it was good. I liked it. <laughs> Cool story. Um, George, do you have a recommendation? 
Um, I I was I just said cool story. Good times. <laughs> cool story, bro. I'm gonna go. We mentioned the sequel here today, um, but the I'm gonna go with the original. Um, 28 days later, because I I watched that yesterday. Actually, um, I really love that film. I think it was a really good change up when it came to. I know they're not zombies, but the zombie apocalypse sort of film. Um, it feels very realistic. The soundtrack I've been listening to it recently is like so haunting and like just like dark. It's really great, and the acting is amazing. Killian Murphy, like all of them, are prefer- apart from the girl who played Hannah. Unfortunately, she was from Liverpool and she was trying to do a London accent, and it. I can't watch the film without hearing this terrible accent with the Scouse accent coming through. I just wish that someone would dub her over with her Liverpool accent. Um, but I love it. Christopher, everyone's Naomi Harris, all of them, perfection, beautiful, scary, creepy, great. Um, yeah, uh, Dave, <laughs> so, David, so, uh, what is what would you recommend, dear? I am going to recommend a movie that I spoke about with my other boyfriend, apparently, Nick, when he was here for this <laughs> Chucky movie. But it, it's 1993's Freaked. Which I I am not on my watch list now. <laughs> this movie, I think you can even find it on YouTube for free. It's like an hour twenty or something like that. It has um Brooke Shields. It has uh what's his name? Uh oh dear, from eighteen. From eighteen, Mister T. Yes, Mister oh, T. Yes, Mister T. That's right. Uh, 18, not eighteen. Sorry. It, yeah, no. Oh, uh, it's if you if you're not into horror but you don't mind a creature feature. Because it's very visual. It's very like over- ridiculous. Over- it's campy. It's stupid. It's like, it's my kind of shit. You know what I mean? Like, it, it's it's kind of like a spoof. Because it's the guy also, um, Quaid from the... the Randy Quaid. The brother. The, the, brother the one from who the went crazy Rampoons. and, like, moved ah. up to Canada to, like, escape, like, jail. I don't know. He's got a weird... History. Really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Anyways, something to Google later. Um, but yeah, it's basically like for mm-hmm. anybody who doesn't like horror and you just want to watch like a funny creature feature, disgusting, gooey, wet. Yeah, it's nasty. Yeah, it's basically like a. Okay. It's almost like a funny coven. I mean, not coven. Uh, freak show. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. A ridiculous funny. Good creature. times. That would be fun. <laughs> yeah. I did look at the uh, cover art. I I do plan to watch that. It's so unhinged. Oh my god, it's so good. I love and it. I do love Brooke Shields. Stunning, gorgeous, yeah. amazing. Well, Liam, take us home. What's yours? And a good um, actress, unlike somebody else. Huh? You? Well, no, I was going to say I'm like... I'm acting! Ha! <laughs> uh... <laughs> Teleport us to Mars. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> uh, so to close it out, it is. It, I'm going to recommend um, the cell. I've already recommended it a bunch of times in here. Um, well, I That's just love it. One. I just love it. I just love Jennifer Lopez. Um, and she's so sexy in the cell. And that movie is just unhinged. Like fucking that horse. <gasps> uh, too much. Um, Megan. Eh. Anyway, so. <laughs> so yes so thank you for watching with us today if you would like to join any uh, listen to any of our other content it is all available anywhere you would like um please do also follow us on twitter instagram which is at the horror hour tv as stated earlier earlier words (laughs) getting Um, choked up as as stated earlier you can also join our patreon um, we have multiple tiers. You're welcome to join us. We do um, low class. Added... <laughs> and we yeah, have, yeah, we do yeah. like a very low class um, extra episode where we mainly just listen to David talking about getting fisted, um, <laughs> and no loop. Okay, and then <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> dry, um, <laughs> like Alma. Um... <laughs> <laughs> We're bringing nuns' pussies into this. Have mercy. Where has the show gone? <laughs> Jesus. What, what happens to me? Uh, I get distracted. ADHD. Ah. Um, <sighs> yes, uh, you get uh, that extra episode. You also get a monthly live stream. We're fun. We also have polls and all that shit. Early get access, all that jazz. All that, yeah, yeah, all of that. Um, so come on over and join us and watch all of the other things and subscribe and like and share and do that. Thank you. Catherine goodbye. Hepburn has come again. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> That's a rat. <laughs> have mercy. You have been listening to the horror hour. See you next time.